Hey everybody, welcome back. Here we've got the general, the seeker general. Um, it's a pin type moisture meter. Uh, I recently acquired a house that needs a bunch of wood for heat. Well, it doesn't need it, but it has a shop with a fireplace and it has a house with a fireplace. So, so a buddy recommended this one. So I got it on his recommendation because he has one and likes it uh, from Amazon. The link will be down below in the description. And we'll get this unboxed, put the battery in it, and we'll test it out here and see how it works in my wood piles. Okay, here it is unboxed. Um, you can see there's a cap on the top here. See if I can get it off there one-handed. I can't. So we'll flip it over on the back here. Here's where the battery goes. So the battery will go in there. One thing to note on the back side of the package here, it came with some spare little prongers. Um, the prongers are up under this lid. I'll take this off in the next deal, but anyways, I'll show you that. But here's some of the info here. It shows you the moisture ranges and whatnot. Okay. Um, obviously, for firewood, you want to be under 20% from what I have learned. But anyways, I'll get the battery in here and get the top off, and we'll show you what's going on there. Okay, I've got the battery in it. There's these little, little rubber caps. It's really hard to see, but anyways, they were on these little prongers. Those are the prongers that'll tell you your moisture. Anyways, so there's that. So we'll power it up for the first time here. As you can hit the mode, you got wood. You see that wood? Or building, which is interesting. Anyways, this stuff here is something that I cut up out of logs last week and split. And it's ready to burn. It's 14%. It works really fast and really well. I'll try another piece here. Yeah, it says high, but... The farther I show it in there, the more it says. So it's close. 17.6. I know they say you want under 20% for burning in fireplaces. Here is some stuff from a buddy which I know has got to be pretty dry. Yeah, look at that. 10.9%. 12.8. Here's some stuff that's been in the woodshed for a very long time. Look at that, really dry. Hope that shows up. Seven and a half. Five and a half. You can feel it when you stick it in there. That one doesn't even register, it's so low. Oh, there we got a seven out of it. Gotta find the right spot, I guess. Pretty cool. So anyway, there's there's that and how it works. Um, we'll switch it to building. There's some building material. This just sits out in the weather. There's some treated stuff. We'll switch the mode here and see what it says. I don't know how that figures that. I don't know that much about that part of it. Anyways, it gives you some readings. So, now you know if your wood's ready to burn or not. Okay, if you take this package apart and inside there is where the instruction manual is. It explains some mm -hmm. other things. Inside the cap here, you see there's a little chipboard. It's got these little holes here for you to do a calibration check. Now when you do that, it says in the manual you should get 18.3% plus or minus 1%. So we will plug that in. If I can get it here one handed. So it's 0.1% off there. Pretty close. Yep. For a couple of hours for 18.2. So there you go. So somehow that calibrates it and tells you what's going on. So there you go. Hope this is helpful. Please subscribe. Give me a thumbs up. And keep coming back for more information. Shut her down. Hold the button. Peace out.
Something else I also thought was funny. Gosh, they're pretty sharp. But I wouldn't burn very good. You got a higher reading earlier. You probably